Hey, and um, welcome back to All My Love Zoe. It's very good to have you with me once again. This is where we discuss fashion, food, and beauty. So if that sounds like something that you would be interested in, then please do hit the subscribe button down below. Now getting on to today's video, it is going to be fashion. I made a Zara purchase. Yes, I know, another one. I am a Zara addict. But I feel like I'm at that kind of age where, unless I was going kind of like high-end designer pieces, which really is not in my budget, there isn't a huge amount of other options to choose from and Zara really does tick a lot of boxes and once you get past looking at all that kind of like weird abstract model stuff going on the website there are some really lovely items on there so if you'd like to see what i've purchased how i plan to style it up and how i plan on transitioning these items right through to spring then please do stick around and i'll show you all so the first couple of pieces that I'm going to show you are actually quite basic pieces. I think basic pieces right now are just perfect. The right basic pieces really can just make you look a bit more put together. So let me show you what I've bought. First off is this bodysuit. Now, like I said, it is really, really simple, basic, but I don't know if you can tell, it is really quite a thick material. It's like ribbed really stretchy and I love it. It has these like popper buttons down the front, which, you know, really can make your chest area look amazing. I got this in a small and it was 14 99 Now I love a bodysuit so much that I got it in the gray. It's a really overlooked color and I think gray really does suit so many people, but I also got it in black, um, which as you can see, it's exactly the same, um, the same style, same cut, has the V-neck, um, with the popper buttons, but I think the black one you can really dress up. I I really like wearing like an all black outfit sometimes. I think it can look really stunning and classic. You don't have to do too much to look really sort of well polished. So yeah, highly recommend the bodysuit. Again, I picked this up in a small and this was also 14 99 now next up is another wardrobe staple and it's this high neck cream sweater and it's quite a thin knit it's a thin material which i actually really like because you know you can layer this up it's not bulky it feels really really soft now i picked this up in a small and it was 19.99 i do believe it comes in lots of other colors as well so you can really take your pick but for me i love a sort of a neutral color palette i just think neutrals look a lot more expensive than they are they're so much easier to style you just can't go wrong they suit so many people hair color skin color eye color you really can put them into your wardrobe and make them work with so many things now this is also super versatile you can style this up with high-waisted flared denim skinny jeans leather trousers the next item in this haul is the only item clothing that i haven't worn yet and it is this high neck knitted dress with a gathered waist quite short but not in a really tarty kind of way um, it has lovely voluminous sleeves quite, as you can see they are really voluminous but I love that I love the design of this it is very stretchy and the material is is really quite thick so it will keep you warm especially in these horrible times where it's like snowy and cold I think this dress will look great with an oversized blazer perhaps a long long coat and boots like you can really dress this up quite easily. Now the last three items are actually my favourite items in the whole haul. I just love them. I think they're really, really cute and I, I'm hoping you'll agree. Next up is this high neck jacquard, is that how you say it? Jacquard sweater. It's short sleeved, has beautiful pattern on there which is kind of wintry. I know it's not exactly like perfect for winter because it has short sleeves but I tend not to care about that because I think if you're going out you're going to have a jacket on anyway. If you're indoors the heating's on. Now I picked this up in a small and it was $25.99. I really like the detailing on the sleeves here that despite not having long sleeves, this still does keep you nice and toasty. The next item is this beautiful, beautiful alpaca wool oversized jumper. Now I picked this up in a small and it was $49.99. So it's quite expensive, but I guess that's down to this alpaca wool. It's almost like just one long piece of material. So it is a cropped style and the sleeves are very very oversized so i don't know if i can show you there you 
obviously the sleeves are almost the same width as the, the width of the jumper. Now this sweater is something that I would advise you layer over a vest or a very, very fine knit top of some description, just because it is cropped and such huge sleeves that you are going to get a little bit cold if you don't really wear something underneath. But despite that, I love it. I just love the style of it. I love the color of it. It just looks expensive. It looks really luxurious and it feels super snuggly. I mean, just look at that. Look how soft it is. It's just so, so nice. And yeah, this is definitely a favorite. I love wearing this. The final item in this Zara haul is this beautiful dusty pink cape, which I am in love with. I think it is the most darling item ever. It's girly, but kind of a grown up girly. Now I picked this up in an extra small and it was $79.99. It's quite thick, it's lined throughout, as you can see here. It's a really, really soft material. It's almost like a brushed felt sort of material. I'm in love with this. I, I love this cape. It is like my favorite item here. Yeah, I just wanna wear this all the time. I think the color is just beautiful. Now I know that it's not exactly the best winter option. However, I've worn this over a suede jacket and it really did keep me lovely and warm. I wanted to get it mainly for that transition from winter into spring when, you know, it can be rainy, it can be cold, but it's not like really cold that you need to wear this like huge chunky jacket. This I think will just bridge the gap between the two. Plus it's just gorgeous, it's so darling. I love this cape, I really do and I'm a sucker for a cape. I just think they look girly but grown up all at the same time. And in this beautiful pink color, this is definitely the one piece that I recommend you pick up. That is everything in today's Zara haul. I will of course link all of the items in the description box below. If you plan on purchasing any of these or perhaps you already have some of these items, please do let me know how you plan to style them up or how you have been wearing them. It would be great to hear from you. I do hope it's given you a bit of inspiration on if not these products, but perhaps similar products you already have that you can wear now and then transition through to springtime, which let's hope is very, very soon. I really hope if you enjoyed today's video if you did please do give me the thumbs up and if you don't already subscribe please do hit the subscribe button and don't forget to check the notification box so you never miss a future video it's great to have you around every single time if you'd like to see a bit more why not follow me over on instagram which i will link just here well until next week take care bye